mirror mirror on the world who is the finest of them all drum roll <laughs> oh my goodness welcome 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 becky got your family welcome to another interesting and fun video it's been a while we kept up with the obaogunsis and his wives and so you know i just decided to come up with this video so in this video we are going to be visiting the ogunsis family again so this is going to be a fun video where we'll take a look at his five wives give a quick background knowledge about them as well as share with you who i think is the most beautiful of them all yeah. <laughs> oh my god this is so funny but before we call when one man has six wives is it not enough for us to do beauty pageants please John, let the contest begin so this video is on a lighter mood nothing too serious or personal just us sharing our thoughts on whom we think is the finest of them all i am not going to be the judge i'm not going to be the only judge you're also going to be telling me who you think is the most beautiful among these five olori of ile ife kingdom so let's go So let's start with his first wife, who is currently the Yeolua of Ileife Kingdom, Olori Miriam. She is in her late 30s and used to work in oil and gas before marrying Oni. She is fair in complexion, not too fat, not too slim, seems to me like a calm and gentle lady from what I can see from pictures and videos, but you know we cannot judge from that. But anyways, here is Olori Miriam. And at number two, we have Olori Toby. This one is fine, Shao. She is even an ex beauty queen. She was World Miss University Africa in 2012. She is in her early 30s from Ondo State. She's a fashion entrepreneur and artist. Ladies and gentlemen, Olori Toby. Then next is Olori Ashley, born into royalty from the ruling house of Lafogido Ileife. She was based in United Kingdom before marrying Oni. She is known to shower herself with praises. She calls herself the princess of the source of Odua, black beauty, always smiling and looking cheerful. Olori Ronke, she was also born into royalty. She is the great granddaughter of late Oni Ajagun Ademiluyi of Ileife Kingdom. She is said to be in the mid 50s. Olori Ronke is the founder of African Fashion Week London and African Fashion Week Nigeria. She is also the CEO of Adire Odua Textile Orb, which is why she always adorns herself with Adire fabrics. She is also also the global ambassador of Queen Moremi Ajasoro International. Olo 
Tori Timitope. She is said to be a divorcee and has worked in the political sector. She has also worked as a TV host and she is currently the CEO of Hope Alive Life Initiative. She was born into the royal family of Ago Iwoye Ijebu. have it the five oloris of Ileife kingdom so who is the finest of them all i'll let you be the judge please go ahead and drop your thoughts opinions decisions comments in the comment section below i'll be waiting to read and reply your comments this broadcast was brought to you by becky culture tv where we share content that evolves around people events and places if you're new to the channel you're most definitely welcome you can become a family member by joining us on our facebook page and our youtube channel i'll be so happy to have you as part of the becky culture family if you're already a family member thank you so much for tuning in and i'll see you in my next one bye for now